what do you think? I mean, this could be a business, right? How many of these can you make a day? Mm, about 20. And how much profit do you make per penny blossom? I don't know, like 50 cents, I'm not sure. No, of course you're not, all right. <laughs> $10 a day times five days a week times 52 weeks a year is $2,600. That's all? Before taxes. Well, I don't have to pay taxes on this stuff. I believe the Internal Revenue Service would strongly disagree. <laughs> But if you took advantage of modern marketing techniques and you optimized your manufacturing process, you might be able to make this a viable business. And you know about that stuff? Penny. <laughs> I'm a physicist. I have a working knowledge of the entire universe and everything it contains. Who's Radiohead? I have a working knowledge of the important things in the universe. Good luck. Sheldon, hold on. Could you maybe show me how to make more money with this? Of course I could. So, wait! Will you? Just to be clear here, you're asking for my assistance. Yes. And you understand that that will involve me telling you what to do? I understand. And you're not allowed to be sarcastic or snide to me while I'm doing so. Okay. Good. Let's begin with the premise that everything you've done up to this point is wrong. Oh, imagine that. Sarcasm, goodbye. No, sorry. Coming round the mountain when she comes. When she comes. She'll be coming round the mountain when she comes. When she comes. She'll be coming round. She'll be coming round. The mountain. You know, if I wanted to spend my Saturday nights doing this, I could have stayed in India. <laughs> oh, stop with the fake third world crap. Your father's a gynecologist, and you had a house full of servants. We only had four servants, and two of them were children. <laughs> How are we doing? We have 128 assorted penny blossoms ready to ship. Oh God, we're never gonna finish in time. Come. When she comes. Oh. Oh. Shut the boss anyway. I believe I'm hearing some negativity on the factory floor. <laughs> so? Yeah, penny, the labor force is a living organism that must be carefully nurtured. Any counterproductive grumbling must be skillfully headed off by management. Mm. Observe. <laughs> hey! Let's talk, more work. <laughs> Nicely done. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You hear any union talk, you let me know. <laughs> so it's in the kitchen with Dyla. Someone's in the kitchen, I know. Ho, ho, ho. Someone's in the kitchen with Dyla. Sheldon. Sheldon. Guns have sold my soul to the company store. <laughs> some coffee? No, I don't drink coffee. Oh, come on, but if you don't stay awake, we'll never finish in time. No, I'm sorry, coffee's out of the question. When I moved to California, I promised my mother that I wouldn't start doing drugs. <laughs> Leonard, help! Yeah, Sheldon, we still have 380 of these things to make. And I have complete faith that you will make them. Good night. Leonard! Uh, you know. But Sheldon, without your insight and leadership, this entire enterprise will surely fail. <laughs> You're right, of course. Here, this will help. Very well. But if this leads to opiates or hallucinogenics, you're going to have to answer to my mother. <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom! Where's the coffee? We're all out. No problem. I'll be back before this banana hits the ground. Zoom, 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 zoom! Zoom, 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 zoom!